of Winnie Nerdigans. This is the one and only Packer Girl 89 and Nerdigans Inc. And today's Mama Nerdigan live reaction video is going to be for Solo Leveling Side Story Chapter 8, aka Chapter 187. So before I get into this recap and live reaction, let me just remind you to hit that like, share, and subscribe buttons. And because of course this channel, let alone this video, are not sponsored. If you love what we're doing and want to help keep this operational alive and kicking so we can keep bringing you more anime, manga, manga content, um, whether it be news, analysis, or live reactions like this one, feel free to hit up the cash app or PayPal. Links are in the description box below. So, we had the date last chapter, and it was so cute. It was so sweet. It was everything. And it ended with a kiss, too, on Christmas. But let's get to this chapter, see what's in store for us this week. And, oh, disciples, I gotta tell ya, Tower of God came back. So, not only do you have villain to kill to compete with, but you have Tower of God. Anyways, but damn, the world of repose, you know, the world of shadows, gorgeous. Gorgeous, the sky is gorgeous. The castle, right? I really want more for this castle. I know they're fucking disciples, but they, re they did this to themselves. The art has been so good, but damn, this castle is very underwhelming. Greetings, Tusk. God, that dragon looks fucking good. I wish there was more details on the scaling on this on, um, on the muzzle, but God, this dragon looks good. Good morning, General Tusk. Good morning is what I'd like to say, but there's no day or night in the world within the shadows. <laughs> And also, light novel readers, I want to know what you guys think about the world of repose. Does it look like how you pictured it? Because I think we've been to the world of repose a few times, but I want to know what you guys think of how the disciples did for um, world of repose. Hmm. <laughs> oh, you must have completed it, Marshal Beru. Yeah. Now, how is this? Ooh. Oh, a rope that looks exactly like the hooded jacket that our Louise wore um, a few days ago. Oh, how should I repay you for this? Hmm. Uh, uh, how can I turn a blind eye to your wish to become more like our liege? As long as you're satisfied with it, it's all good. I like it very much. Ooh, that jacket looks so good. Ooh, like a good kitty. Zeno is here. Hi, Hi, kitty. Do you want a jacket too? Hi, Shadow Kitty. No, you just want to be pet. Hi, Shadow Kitty. Hi, Noisy Shadow Kitty. It's been nothing but meowing from this one. I swear. So much that I'm almost tempted to make it every magic soldier's duty to wear this robe, Marshal. Yeah, hmm, but that orb, wouldn't it be better to turn it into a stab and wield it rather than carry it around in your hand? Hmm. That's a great idea, Marshal. You bearded, um, you bearded dwarves. If you are truly the best Artesians, I can entrust you with my staff. Correct? Yes. Leave it to us. Dude, the dwarves look bomb. I can't. Uh, I'm. But <sighs> the only problem I'm having is the beard, though. The beard looks weird. The shadows behind them look good, but that beard, man. Ugh. Oh, questionable. Questionable, questionable, questionable. This is the world of repose. It is infinitely vast, and because there are close to 10 million soldiers residing here, everyone lives here by assisting one another. Demon Castle, player growth system, um, player center of the architect, uh, player advancement area, Bellion's uh, soldier training uh, region, bearded dwarfs manufacturing zone, Ashbourne's battle zone, mines, and colony. Um, the magic training zone, dude, that ant colony looks awesome. The commercial zone, the rusting zone. The soldiers are deeply connected to the mind of the, uh, of the monarch, and as the power of the monarch becomes stronger, they begin to resemble the current monarch's mind. In other words, the soldiers who desired destruction and strived uh, for such were starting to learn the human, humane side of things. Oh, this background is so pretty. Um... The many emotions that humans have. It was a refreshing experience to fill, um, fill empty hearts with something new. Dude, this 
background. I wish the soldiers looked better. But God, the background looks good. Stand up straight, giants. Soldiers that are sleeping. Oh, they're sleeping. <laughs> sleeping in class. Soldiers that are training. Soldiers that are chatting. Aww. And even soldiers that grab each other by the collar and raise their voices. Their non-existent characteristics began to form and they began living in this world with their destiny. Or with their diver- oh my god. The non-existent characteristics began to form and they began living in their world with their diversity. God, this is beautiful. Dragons actually- um, Dragons could look a little bit better but here, but they look good. They, I thank my liege for inviting me into a world that I never imagined. I like my liege very much. Oh, it's finally complete! Very good, it's wonderful. Ooh. I think the world, um, the world wonderful would better suit the robe you're, oh, you're wearing than the staff. Huh. Ooh, I see that you have quite the fashion sense. Ooh, that staff is fucking awesome. It's the best. Look at great, General Tusk. Hmm. Who are you all? Great Marshal Bellion told us to come to this place. So there uh, were magic soldiers among the new recruits. What a waste of their bulk blasting magic with that size. Wait, is that something I should be saying? Um, from here on I shall de uh, describe in detail what I've accomplished during the first battle our great liege uh, fought against the Dragon King. And every um, achievement I had accomplished in the rifts of um, dimension. So listen carefully and what are you all waiting around here for? What? Who dares to say that I'm wandering around when I'm displaying the fashion of the robe that resembles our liege? Just who dares to? I, oh, I love you, Commander. Um, I'm always thankful for your loyalty as well. But what business do you have to, uh, to come looking for me? I'm going. It's going to begin soon. Don't you think that all the soldiers above the general grade who closely serve the liege uh, should cheer for him? Huh? huh? So our liege finally met Lady Hayen? Yep. Ooh, this is so pretty. Disciples, what is with these backgrounds looking so good? Like, correct. Ooh, yeah, it's like watching The Fucking Bachelor or something. It's like watching, it's like, not, not The Bachelor, fuck The Bachelor. It's just like watching your favorite, no, I'm going to compare this to, God damn it, I have to compare this to Sex and the City. This is like watching Sex and the City. And seeing, um, like, Big and Carrie, uh, uh, reunite at, um, the end of, uh, end of the series in Paris. That's what this reminds me of. <laughs> or, like, shit, when, um, when you see, like, Big come o um, over to Carrie, like, you, when you see that limo, like, come up, uh, come over to Carrie's place and he has, like, the blues or something like that. That's what it just gives me. I fucking hate it. And just like that. And just like that could go to fucking hell. But I'm I'm a Samantha girl, okay? I love Samantha. She's the best fucking character. If I have to compare it to Carrie and Big, this is such a Carrie and Big situation. Oh god, it really does feel like Carrie and Big reuniting. It does. I know it's so weird. I love it so much. God damn it, I love fucking Sex and I love Sex and the City. I love the first movie. The first movie is so good. Wah! God damn it. Now I want to watch Sex in the City. God, I love how that I love how that show has st has stood the um, the test of time. God damn it. Hmm. The place I met him for the first time was a strange dimension made from the power of the monarch. Ooh. My mission was to test him um, who had entered there. Since my liege wanted to see him, he was a human worthy enough to become his vessel. I knew at that point that it was the final order that my liege had commanded me. At that time, I was already assuming the farewell for my liege. Um, and that my liege who had lost interest in war after forgiving the rulers would have sufficient res reasons as to why he'd show that much interest in that in insignificant human. My liege's orders are absolute. Without even thinking of asking for his intent of um, or dissuading him, I could only answer that I would follow his orders. That was all I could do. And so I stood there alone in that strange dimen dimension to test his qualifications with most of um, my original power sealed. 
Don't the people of this world call this kind of dimension a dungeon? This appearance is, um, it, it's the form I have before I encounter my liege. No matter how many infinite powers the world of repose had, to think that it was, um, uh, it, it was able to recreate the exact senses at that time as well. That architect, he was able to, um, make the, the architect, wait, that architect, he was able to make this refined stage, um, by using the powers of the liege. Only that level of elaborateness could, would be able to make that human's body into a body that uh, would slowly accept the powers of the liege. Is he here already? I can sense his presence beyond the door. Come. I will be waiting for you here. Hmm. Doesn't this make me a too bit of, Wait. Doesn't this make me um, a bit too... Wait. I fuck this up. Doesn't this make me a bit too arrogant? Isn't it a bit uh, disrespectful? The human that will be tested now has the consciousness of the liege imbued inside him. It's a bit strange to show myself sitting on the throne before the liege. Then where should I be? So he's the person that was chosen by the liege. Even if the mission wasn't the last mission entrusted to me, I had no thoughts of being negligent in this battle. If he is considered to be insufficient, then he will die by my hands. Very well, I will test you. Blood Red Commander um, Gris, there we go. Whether you be, then I will test you whether you befit um, this throne or not. And so the battle against him had started, but the result was disappointing. He was busy invading my sword, not possessing the talent nor the abilities to overpower the abilities I have before my death. However, since I can't inflict any damage on him without striking the, um, the inside of his armor, I suppose this is the only method. Is he planning to defeat me with his bare hands? Hmm, that's a courage for a human. I like his animated gaze, but does he have the skills to match it? Hmm. Even if his body may not be fit for the leash uh, just yet, I will honor that will, that will alone. How disappointing. It's a disappointment. How could this feeble being possess the qualifications to become the be um, vessel of the liege? Give up, weak human. You do not belong in that position. I will not um, now proceed with the beheading uh, for an honorable death. I was relieved by the failure of my liege for the first and the last time. If he did not possess the qualification to inherit the power, then the liege would be able to stay as my liege for a bit longer. I'll sever your head and end you painlessly. Hmm. And I couldn't help but be surprised. Not about the fact that he had blocked my sword, but that he um, hadn't given up on his life till the very end of the situation. It's not over yet. Ooh, get him, Jim Wu. I'm going, I'm going to be defeated just like that by a human much weaker than me? Yeah, bitch. Ah, I see. Even if it was just a glimpse of his gaze, it might resemble, uh, might resemble the liege. The difference in the powers that I had, um, and he had, since it was a test to confirm his qualifications, I should have, mu um, much higher, wait, I should have had much higher stats than him. But I still lost. Mm-hmm. Was it because I was careless, or was it a miracle created by um, uh, his tenacity of never giving up? I wasn't sure if I was supposed to be happy that my leash's choice had been correct, and so I had lost to him. Great work. And he had cherished me. The, um, there were a few moments when I was thankful for the kindness I had felt from him. I guess I could talk to you once uh, your grade goes up, right? To me, he was my master, a friend, and a comrade. I had fought many battles alongside him. As my loyalty to him deepened, I knew that my lo uh, longing for my previous master began to wane, and I slowly came to accept my new liege. Later, his forces became much more powerful after um, after the addition of the original Shadow Legion that was waiting for his call in the Rifts of Dimension. Uh, Bellion, who was my old comrade, had finally joined. But the joy of meeting again quickly passed. Bellion began to be affected by his loyal yet ferocious roommate. Hey, this black flag, 
Um, wouldn't our liege like it if I were to uh, place it atop the castle? Are you serious? Rebellion beat the living daylights out of Baron Lula is a bit refreshing. <laughs> Gee, is that a flag for our liege? Well, I think Master's response was, Baron, get over here. My king, grovel. Why did you put... Oh, uh, why did you put that flag there? Ah, oh, was it your plan? Soon our um, determination was used in the battle against the monarchs. Oh god, this panel is so pretty. Our master slowly began to uh, become um, skillful in battles, and we became much stronger as well. Well, and Kitty became a stronger Kitty. Yes, he did. So, you know, you've got these fucking eye bogeys. Stop doing that. Uh, I know your body can't stop producing eye bogeys. You're just a fucking fuss budget Kitty. Stop being a fuss budget. Just be a Kitty. Just be my good Kitty. Our master um, slowly began to become um, uh, skillful in battles, and we became much stronger as well. Just come sleep on my lap. Just be a kitty. Uh, the battle continued even after turning back time with the cup of reincarna reincarnation. Arise! And so about thirty years. Um, and so, about thirty years, all the enemies were annihilated, and only the Legion of Destruction was left. I like that we're seeing what happened now. Egress, you, who was once one of the wings of the Shadow Army? Wait, let me read this again. Egress, you, who was once the wings of the Shadow Army? You, yet you, who followed the orders of a monarch who was once a mere human, have you no shame? He was right. I have forgotten that. Um, because my time with my new master was so um, honorable, I, li I had lived completely, completely forgetting my previous master. Since when was it like this? And my previous master started disappearing from my mind. My liege, why did you not tell that person the truth? They say that forgetfulness is a blessing that God bestowed onto humans, even if that may be an artificial result created by the tool of God. I see. Blessing of forgetfulness. Hmm. Yes, there wasn't any need to think too hard about this. As I thought, so it was you. I did not forget my previous liege. Is this what you call love? Though Greed and Iron, who were overlapped at the time here, and their spirits had forgotten everything and were living their ordinary lives, I was still next to my liege. Excuse me, um, we, have we met somewhere before? Um, we, excuse me, have we, um... I'm sorry. Um, excuse me, we went somewhere before. There we go. My feelings for him were simply connected to my current liege. I'm a knight, the sword of my liege. One of the wings who lead the Shadow Army. My liege. Um, the answer to question 14 isn't one, but two. Ah, is that so? Thanks. Who would assist my liege except me? Grand Marshal Bellion, who's um, only big as a um, who's only big as a mountain, um, or Commander Bear, who's um, only an insect, no matter how smart he is. Only I, who graduated from the Knight Academy, with top scores, could aid my liege. Hmm. But the answer to question fourteen, it says it's one. Could um, risk your life on it being two. Seems my discipline is still lacking. Uh, I will strive for more, my liege. I am the knight of my liege, the sword of my liege. The battlefield of my uh, liege is my battlefield as well. Since my liege had slipped into a new battlefield, it seems that my glorified life will continue for a bit longer. Aww. Aww, Bellion. Oh, I like this chapter. Because for Bellion, we didn't know much about him. At least in terms of the mama. I like that we, using Bellion, we got to know what the fuck happened. Um, a little bit of what the fuck happened. And we got to see the world, too. A world of repose. So it's, uh, so it's the cup of reincarnation, too. So I like seeing this. This was good. And Disciples, just that castle, man. The outside of the castle did not look good. But the art is looking good. I would say my biggest complaint is the armor 
on the shadows is still looking bulky. That's my biggest issue. It's looking, it's looking very heavy because like when you think of the sh these shadows, okay, at least for me, these shadows are supposed to be light, very. But I guess in, uh, I guess in the um, world of repos, they could, they probably be a little bit heavier, but not like this heavy. I think it would be for me. I, I think even in the world of repos, wouldn't it be? I think like a little bit, a little bit lighter. At least for me. I know it's weird, but it's my ADHD, I guess. But let me know your thoughts in the comment section below what you guys saw of this chapter. I really did like this. I kind of, if we get more chapters, and I, I'm very curious what you guys think. If, um, and light novel readers, I want to know if this is canon, what happened here, if this was in the epilogue or not. Because if this wasn't and this is uh, filler, which I would not be mad at. I kind of wonder if we're going to get more chapters like this where we'll get to see more from um, the different shadows because I kind of like that. I do. Um, but let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. And remember to like, comment, share, and subscribe to Nerdkin Zinc. I love what we're doing and want to help keep this operation um, alive and kicking so we can keep bringing you more um, uh, soul leveling content. few ways you could do that. Donate to our cash app, PayPal, Patreon, purchase something off our Amazon wish list. All that's in the description box below. Also make sure you follow us on Twitter, Twitch, Discord, friend us on PlayStation Network. That's in the description box below as well. Till next time, Nerdkins, I will be seeing you later. Bye.